that. What I was going to worry about is if I did get my racket on it, what was I going to do with that shot? And the thing that I counted on time and time again was the faster the ball comes, the faster it's going to go back with less effort. So my grips allowed me for quick changes, whether it's going to come to my backhand or to my forehand, which is another thing to consider when you're choosing your grip in tennis. And I also recognize that because I don't have to do as much, for me it was only about rotating my hips and my racket was plenty far back enough to use the pace and return the shot with interest. Second serve, I took a whole different mentality towards it. It was my goal and objective to make them worry about missing first serves. So when they hit a second serve that I was in position for, I would put a little bit more on it, take a little bit more of a risk, knowing that even if I missed it, I was leaving an impression on them and making them worried about the next time.